We're about to take these rollers out. I opted for a table stand today instead of my tripod because it's more stability and we're going to be working with braiding today. Always set up your SMA. Definitely crunchy. <laughs> and there's so many different shapes and sizes because we were like practicing the different pin curl bases and partings and wet barrel curls. And I also threw another little finger wave in there. I'm gonna make a better way. Hey, hey. Already got the world on me. Give a pretty brown girl a space. You can keep your winner. I'm gonna make a better way. Hey. I think I like the roller set better. <laughs> These are giving more like Hollywood glam curls. I just don't have enough in her head. Yeah. Slip without tying my hair down. Seeking approval constantly. They give height for sure, because this one was a barrel curl. Mm -hmm. This, looks like almost this one was set. the bar barrel curl, and it definitely gives height. Yeah. Especially if you do on this base. Which, do you remember which one's on this base? This one was on yep. base, and this one was like half yep. off, I think. See the difference of an on base and half on? Which yeah. one gets more body? Okay. It looks, it looks, I, yep, go ahead. I toned it out a little bit more. Okay, I want to call my roller set out like even more and see what it looks like at the end. I want to do like the infamous wrap but her ends are terrible so it's like so hard to come through. And we teased, we back combed her with the brush. We teased her at the root so. I'm combing through all of that as well. If y'all don't know. I've literally if never been able to do a wrap. <laughs> Can you tell? <laughs> it's always this part right here. Cause she curled. <laughs> Help! <laughs> oh, it's coming. It's coming together a little bit. Yeah, 
she literally looks exactly the same. So I'm about to go wash this one out so we can get all of that good product out of her hair and move on to braiding. You guys can all see that. I get into our braid styles. I'm done with my mannequin head. We had to do different braid types, so I got some cornrows here on the top. You know, she got her three straight backs. And then we had to do overhand, underhand, which is uh, on top, visible and invisible. That's the terminology here, which is overhand, underhand, visible, and invisible. And we had to do rope braids, which is really like a twist, a bamboo braid. And a fishtail. You could have done a visible braid. Like, You'd be good. Like, okay. Oh, I didn't even show you guys. We got our curly girls today. Mine's is in the bag, and y'all, the heads is looking a hot crazy mess. We gotta get that together. <laughs> Clean up time. Get all packed up and ready to go. That's gonna be the end of the day too. You can do better.